everybody, this is Josem, and welcome to another uh, QML tutorial. And in this tutorial we're going to be learning about uh, property animation and how to start something differently than how we did it before uh, in our last tutorial. So we can take the code from our last tutorial and get rid of it. And uh, we can start a mouse area down here underneath our main image. So let's do that. We're going to anchor fill it. Alright, that's all for right now. Now we're going to make a property animation. We're going to give it the ID of scale animation. We're going to target the main image. We are going to set look for the property of scale. We are going to say from 0 to 1 and set the duration to 1200 and the easing dot type to easing out back. up a little bit and we are going to now make a numbered animation we're going to give this one the ID of uh, opacity animation same deal we're targeting the main image for the property though this time of opacity and we're going to say the same deal from, oh, indexed in there, from 0 to 1, duration, and we'll say 2800, and then we will say using dot type, and we will say using dot out. And we will clean up our code. Now, let's go back over to our mouse area here that's anchor filling our main image. And let's set A on clicked. Okay. Scale animation dot start. Capacity animation dot start. Okay, so we're going to start those when we click on any one of these images, right? Um, so it, it should just go each image by image, and it shouldn't be like the whole thing. So let's give her a shot. So there they go. They, they come up, right? And then we can click on it, and then it does the animations for us. Uh, so it's just single element animations within a model. Right, and uh, of course we could have kept the behavior on scale and stuff, but do, that would just kind of ruin this um, single animation ones. Anyways, that is how you use property animations, and there is also like uh, start, stop, reload. Um, there's all sorts of different ones. If we look at our property animation and press F1 to go into the help page. Is start stop and so on and so forth maybe it'll say it underneath number of animations sometimes you gotta hunt through the okay here we go start stop resume pause restart and complete those are the kind of uh, playback animations that you can start to use so we did start before and uh yeah anyways this is joseph um more about animations coming up soon